Hey guys, hey everyone, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night, good twilight, good whatever it is where you are. It's your girl Twin D and thank you so so much for stopping by the channel everyone. If you're new here, welcome, 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 welcome to the camp, happy to have you. And for all my love, long time, I was gonna say love time, <laughs> for all my long time subscribers, you know the drill. Big up on yourself and thank you all for your support enough respect to you guys let's jump right in and let's see what's going on with your divine masculines our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for thine is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever amen all right guys let's see why is there why is there no communication <laughs> why is there no communication father god with these divine masculines and divine feminines what's going on with the masculines you have surprise so someone's getting a surprise here something is gonna be said Something is gonna be said. It's like sometimes we are sitting down and we just like the question I ask and we're wondering why is there no communication? What's going on? And then all of a sudden, boom, here comes something. 41, 14, 144. So those numbers may be coming to you guys. You're going to receive something. It's like, it's, like, um, it's like you're thinking that this door is closed. This door is open. I mean closed. And you can't or you will not receive communication. There will be no more contact. And then poof, <laughs> all of a sudden communication coming in. So what is this happening with these divine masculines? Please? Oh, Jesus. I love where this message is leading to. I love it. Reconciliation. There's a return happening here. There's someone who is thinking nothing is going to happen. Two, three, two. And then out of the blue. Out of the blue. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. And don't look that it's coming tomorrow or today or next week. It is called a surprise. Surprise. Okay, listen. When you're getting a surprise, you don't know when it's happening. You don't know how it's going to happen. Surprise! It's a surprise. That's why it's called a surprise. If you want to know when the surprise is going to be or how it's going to happen, you, well, then you're a control freak. And that's something you got to work on. All right? So, all I say all the time, <laughs> just know that it's coming. Just know that it's happening. And let it be. Let it be, let it be, let it be. But someone's about to be shocked. Ah! Someone's about to be shocked. You have flatterer. So, see see again, look. Four, 14 now. 14 now. So these numbers are significant here. Some of your divine masculines, they are, they are like with, are surrounded by um, manipulators and narcissists these people who are trying to keep your divine masculine from finding their way from moving on to what they're truly passionate about it's like it's like they're being somebody using their fears against them there could be some friends involved here that's like trying to you um deviate your masculine away from you you know them bad mind ones the ones that can't stand to see anybody as happy so they pretend that they're happy for you when they're with you so that you keep them in their in your circle because they themselves are dependents codependent jealous but these are the kind of people that I'm sensing around your divine masculines, and that's why there's no communication. It's like, it's like they're being forced, but they're being manipulated to not reach out, to stay away from you. 
Bad advice. Bad advice. What else is happening with these divine masculines, please? You have tenderness. So some of you, your divine masculines are missing you at this point. They're missing you. Your divine masculines, they are feeling like not only do they miss you, but like they're missing out on something because you're not there. Some of your divine masculines are going through um, court cases. Whatever the issue is, this may involve children as you see there. But this is something that's allowing your divine masculines to find love again. Some of your divine masculines are holding back because there are children involved. And it's hard to just... One day you're with your children. The next day you gotta leave home. So it's kind of hard for these divine masculines. But they're learning to change their mind they're learning to change their thoughts they're learning to focus on what's truly important love and real realizing that not because they're outside of the home means there's no love so they're coming to some great understanding here in regards to what love is and i'm seeing the 144 again Somebody's about to celebrate, man. I, I'm hearing celebrate, celebrate. That's what I'm hearing, celebrate. You have the city house here. So, for some of your divine masculines, it is because of um, whatever society may say that they're holding back. So, they have issues that they need to deal with. Issues that is in regards to their roots. How they were brought up, the way they were taught to look at things, the way they view things. There could be um there could be a difference between you two, religion, age. You know, but whatever the difference is, they may think that society will not agree, and it's 4224 that I'm looking at. So there's a lot of fours in this message. And the four 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 four, it, it it's about it, it's about telling you that you're on the right path. So it's like keep going, keep going, whatever you're doing, keep going. And you have presents. I told you, man, there's gonna be a celebration. So after this period of feeling like nothing is gonna happen, then you're gonna receive your surprise. Then you're gonna be getting a gift. And this is going to be something precious, something kind, something gentle. I don't know what it is, but it sounds like love to me. <laughs> and you have hope. So your divine masculines here, they're hoping, hoping, hoping that there's still affection here. Hoping that you still love them. Hoping that you still want to be with them. So they're doing a lot of thinking. Give me something on this surprise, please, Father God. Give me something on this surprise. Oh! <laughs> you saw that! I told you, somebody is about to be happy. Thank you, Jesus. I'm thanking you from now, okay? Father God, I'm thanking you from now. Even before I see it. I love surprises, especially when it involves love, my friends, especially when it involves love and this love is protected. No matter the temptation that the masculine is going through, no matter what you have been going through, your connection is protected. Like I said, it doesn't matter what you're going through, nine of ones, it doesn't matter what you're facing, this love will come together. And you will receive that communication that you deserve when it's the right time. That's why I say don't go looking for it. When you go looking for it, you're going to push it away. So keep your ass at home, all right?
and behave yourself. Just relax. What about this reconciliation, please, Father God? Tell me more about this reconciliation, please. You have the Wheel of Fortune and the Five of Pentacles. So, this separation, this divide, this lack, you think the cycle is like going to go like this. The cycle is about to be completed. Whatever happened that caused the separation or whenever the separation happened, it was for a reason. It was for a reason and now this person can come back to you. There they are. Coming in, rushing in with passion, love, desire. This person is changing. This person had to work on a lot of insecurities here. But they're working on their spiritual enlightenment. Seeing more clearly. Thinking more clearly. And they will take action when it's the right time. Give me something on this flatterer, please. These nasty ass flatterers. Give me something on them, please. Tell me more about them, please. Yeah, see, there are the reasons that cause your Divine Masculine to close off from you. To not be saying anything, to lock off their heart, you know. Probably even they are telling them, oh, this person is not meant for you. This person would destroy your life. Oh, man, eh, eh, the, all kind of foolishness. But they were the reason your Divine Masculine turned away from you. They are the reason there is no communication. But your Divine Masculine, like I said, they're becoming more spiritual, more understanding. And they're opening up. Their eyes are opening up. The world. They're completing that cycle. They're completing that cycle. Tell me something about this tenderness, please, Father God. All right, give me one more. <laughs> Ace of Wands and the Hierophant. Your person, your divine masculine, definitely wants this new start. And like I was saying before, for some of you, there are some differences between you and your divine masculines. Race, religion, age. There it is. They're wanting that new start. They're missing you. They love you. And they want that commitment. And it's going to be a passionate new beginning. That's the Ace of Wands, man. And strength. So your Divine Masculine is that they're conquering their fears. They're conquering those flatterers. And they're coming in for that reunion. They're facing their fears, guys. This is what they needed to do here. So they could have had this reconciliation. That's why you went through separation. But now is the time. For you and them to reconcile. Oh, dear, the lovely night. You gotta start from somewhere. 1313. And they're coming in with a lot of passion and desire. Uh, be careful though. For some of these who are masking, they may still have some of that insecurity left. There may still be insecurities that they are struggling with. So look out for, well, don't look out for nothing. Don't look out for anything. Just let it flow. Just let it be. Just let it be. They still have a, some kind of fear on the inside. That's why you got to be tender, be gentle. Just think about the future. Just think about the outcome. You know? And know that it will happen for you and them. All you got to do is trust them. All you got to do is let them heal. That's all you got to do. Let them heal. You're making decisions. Some of your masculines taking trips. Some of your masculines are leaving home. Some of your masculines are making that decision to come towards you. Like I said, they're realizing that even if you're not at home, in the home, it doesn't mean that love is dead. Yeah, avoiding commitment will not commit. That's them flatterers. Flatterers that were causing your divine masculine to not reach out. Work on your health. 
so some of your divine masculines they may be working on their health here some of them may have been sick or whatever controlled by ego some of your divine masculines this sickness may have caused may be caused from um unhappiness sadness and then they went into depression cannot make a decision yeah they couldn't make the decision and what the oh this will lead to marriage of course but you gotta experience what you gotta experience first messages coming in baby messages coming in there you go five three five and that's the truth about your message guys this is my truth deck you see it doesn't lie oracle of truth you can find it on make plain cards that come the link is in my description box below it will take you straight to my store over there you can purchase it if you want this that doesn't lie to you you know but anyways guys this has been your message to purchase your book or a reading go to twin d dot square dot site love you guys don't forget to join me on tiktok and instagram later love you all let go let god